is my dog, Vixie. Hi, Vixie. <laughs> All right. Mm. Put you over there. Oh. All right. Hello, everybody, and uh, welcome back to the Lick a Day segment of today. <laughs> Uh, as you can see, I have my, uh, my red Charvel, Avenger. I had just got her back from the shop, and, uh, love, love, love this thing. Anyway, today we'll we be talking about, since we have a devilish looking guitar, we'll be look, we'll be talking about some devilish licks. The devilish arpeggios, or the diminished arpeggio. And the very, the most common way people do arpeggios of that nature are, you know, and that's cool and all, but the way I like to do them is uh, it's like this. That's how I like to do them. And uh, the first little segment of that is what we're going to focus on today. Uh, for this little lick, you need to be uh, familiar with my previous uh, technique, the uh, sweep pick, because it's a miniature sweep as well. The way I do it is I start off on the 15th fret, go on the 12th fret, then I sweep the 14th fret of the B string and the 15th fret of the G string. I pull this off, by the way. And sometimes I hit the, the 12th fret of the G string. But very rarely. And then what I do is that when I sweep back up, I tap the 18th fret of the E string. Then I pull it off, pull off, sweep, Hammer on, uh, legato, and the way I like to do this lick is I like to go from one segment of the uh, full scale to the other. Then I, I usually go up, tap it twice, and then slide this finger to the next position, which is approximately three frets away. So there's a distance of two frets. And then you put, so that's like basically like, basically it's basically positioning these two fingers right here. Instead of it being on the 15th fret, it's actually going to go to the, where I tapped it, to the 18th fret. And then this one will be on the 15th fret, and then we're going to, you know, uh, sweep down to the 17th fret and back to the 18th. And I'm going to tap the 19th, 20th, 20, 21st fret. And I can go back to the 15th fret position. And then I'll slide this one, put this one on the 12th fret. And then so on and so on and so on and so forth. And for those of you that want to get a little bit more challenged, then we can do this for a while. And then you can go down the whole scale, which would require you to do uh, the first half. Hit the uh, the G uh, the twelfth fret of the G string. Hit the fourteenth uh, fret of the D string, and then hit the sixteenth fret on the A string. And then hit the thirteenth fret on the A the A string as well. I can't do that one very fast, but I mean, it, it sounds cool when you when you do the. It sounds cool to me. Uh, something like that. Anyway, 
that's uh that's the lick of the day and uh again questions comments let me know uh if you want something a little bit more difficult or a little bit uh less hard then again let me know and uh say bye to vixie <laughs>